In the quiet town of Everwood, nestled beneath a canopy of ancient oaks, a centuries-old mansion stood as a relic of the past. The Palmer estate, as it was known, had long been abandoned and shrouded in dark rumors. Locals whispered about the mirrors within, saying they held an unsettling power, capable of revealing one's deepest fears and desires. Catherine, a curious artist with an inclination for the macabre, had heard these tales her entire life. Her obsession with the mansion and its mirrors drew her to it, and on a misty Halloween night, she decided to explore the estate alone. Armed with only a flickering candle, she crossed the threshold and entered the foreboding mansion. The grand foyer was dominated by an immense mirror that seemed to devour the candlelight. Catherine's reflection stared back at her with vacant eyes, and an unsettling feeling washed over her. She moved through the mansion, finding more mirrors, each more haunting than the last. As she gazed into the mirrors, her own reflection seemed to change. It grinned wickedly, its eyes filled with malevolence. Catherine's heart raced, but she couldn't look away. Her reflection whispered dark secrets, feeding her deepest insecurities and fears. Catherine tried to leave, but the doors had vanished, replaced by more mirrors. Panic set in as she felt her grasp on reality slip away. Her reflection taunted her, revealing truths she'd buried deep within her psyche. With each passing minute, Catherine's mind unraveled further. The mansion became a labyrinth of torment, and she couldn't distinguish reality from illusion. She saw twisted versions of herself in the mirrors, terrifying, grotesque parodies of her own existence. As the night wore on, Catherine's mind teetered on the brink of madness. She screamed, but the mirrors absorbed her cries. Desperation consumed her, and she felt herself becoming one with the distorted reflections. Then as the clock struck midnight, the mirrors shattered and Catherine's consciousness fragmented. She was left in a state of perpetual torment, forever entangled in the blurred line between reality and illusion. The townsfolk never saw Catherine again, and the Palmer estate remained a dreaded place, a testament to the horrifying power of the mirrors that could strip away the sanity of anyone who dared to look too deeply into their depths. And so, the legend of the cursed mirrors in the Palmer estate lived on, a chilling reminder of the thin boundary that separates the human psyche from the darkest recesses of the mind.